Oh, I think there's going to be a storm. Get out of the pool before the lightning strikes, little kitty. No, let there be lightning. Oh no, little kitty. Playing outside during lightning is very dangerous. Hey friends, have you ever wondered what exactly these hot rays could do to us? Well, in today's episode, let us explore this thundering situation and answer a terrifying question. What happens when you're struck by lightning? Zoom in! Lightning. We already learned a lot about it in our previous video called What Causes Lightning? And what we understood from it is that it's a force to reckon with that has the power to destroy anything crossing its path. Though it looks like a rare phenomenon, however, you'll be shocked to know that some places can experience lightning as much as 100 times per second which comes down to a whopping 3 billion times a year. But despite its frequent bombarding, the chances of someone getting hit by it in their lifetime is pretty low. And contrary to popular belief, getting struck by a lightning bolt isn't always fatal as 90% of the victims actually survive. Although, for some miraculous reasons, a victim won't get cooked like those cartoons we see on TV. Still, it's important not to underestimate its ultimate power as it can undoubtedly cause some permanent damage to most survivors. Yes, as we learned in the previous video, lightning carries around 1 to 10 billion joules of energy which is enough to light an electric bulb for about 3 months. But if this amount of electric current passes through our body, it breaks the electrical rhythm that runs our heart, leading to a cardiac arrest. Not only that, but the shock could also cause seizures or respiratory arrest. And if the electric current enters your skull, it could result in brain damage that can put someone in a coma or could even cause temporary or permanent paralysis. Also, the electrical current isn't the only matter of concern. Yes, a lightning bolt is tremendously hot that can superheat the surrounding air up to 50,000 degrees Fahrenheit, which is about five times hotter than the surface of the sun. These heat waves cause a rapid expansion of air which leads to a shockwave that you hear as a thunderous rumbling sound. So, it is estimated that if someone comes within 30 feet of a lightning strike point, they can experience a blast wave equal to a 5 kilogram TNT explosion. It's not uncommon for the blast to rupture your eardrums, possibly leading to hearing loss, Plus, the scorching heat along with the electric current can badly damage your eyes too. And the damage is not limited to your inner parts. Yes, as the current passes towards the surface, it can burst the red blood cells out of your capillaries into the surface of the skin called the epidermis that might create something called a Lichtenberg figure on your skin. This is a pattern of scars that branches out across your body like the limbs of a tree. Well, that's one tattoo nobody would like to have. I know what you're thinking, but how do we save ourselves from the wrath of lightning? Well, the best option is to stay out of its way by staying indoors. But if you find yourself stuck outside during a storm, Make sure not to stand under a tree, near a pole or even an open field and run like the flash towards safety, most likely under a building or in a vehicle. Trivia time! Did you know the irrational fear of lightning is known as Kiranophobia? Also, the famous saying, lightning never strikes twice 
is just a myth as it can strike the same location many times. Hope you learned something new in today's episode. Until next time, it's me, Dr. Binox, zooming out. Oh, please, do not try this at home.